Hey yo, what's going on everybody, it's Tyler, it's aka Ty Killing Tinder. yeah man, alright, listen guys, I have a good one for you today, this is a awesome money guide, alright, due to the fact that we have a bonus event week with import to export being 1.5 bonus on the sales, and the guide that I'm bringing you today, I've worked this all out, there's two different types of methods that I can give you today, but I'm really proud of this method because not only is it effective, efficient, easy, the two different methods are for people that are two different price ranges of where they're at. Maybe you don't have a whole bunch of money or whatnot, but the money ends up being almost identical. It's very, very similar, and you can make a tremendous amount of money, okay? This is not clickbait. This is not bullcrap. I'm telling you, if you grind hard, you can make up to $10 million per day, 100% solo, 100% legit. Now, make sure you have your import-export warehouse filled up with roughly 10 or 11 mid-range and 10 or 11 standard range cars. That way, you're only sourcing top-range vehicles, and now you're only going to sell top-range vehicles to maximize your income and your profit, all right? And I have videos on how to do that, and you can check that out on my channel. It's very, very easy to make sure you can source only top range and sell top range. But like I said, this method is very efficient. It is effective. It's easy, and you will make so much money, you guys, okay? Now, before you start selling, make sure you make your rounds and get your passive businesses filled up, your bunker, your MC businesses, nightclub will be cooking in the background. All those things are going to be part of this method, all right? So you take care of that, get your passive income uh, set up, get those businesses cooking and producing uh, products so you can sell that at a later time, all right? Go ahead and sell a import-export top-range car. And as you know, you have a 20-minute cooldown for the one import export vehicle that you sell and inside that uh, that 20 minute cooldown you want to first source another top range vehicle so you pay yourself back and then you start moving on to some of the more active methods of making money first you'll start out with a client job okay now of course you have to have a terabyte and like I said a little bit later on I have another option for you in case you don't have a terabyte yet but this is one of the most important vehicles to have as a money grinder a terabyte so make sure if you have that you're going to use that in this method okay so for example i'm doing steal the diamonds one of the easiest i mean <laughs> uh client jobs you can do literally takes about a little over two minutes to get this done and complete this all right uh, of course the mark ii oppressor uh, another must-have vehicle for a money grinder probably top two or if not the most important vehicle uh it's right up there with a the terabyte for a money grinder all right now once again if you don't have that that's okay you can use a buzzard you can use a armored karuma or a vehicle of your choice it'll all still work now you're it won't be as quick but it'll still be effective don't worry about that all right don't sweat that small stuff and after doing this method for a, a day you'll have all the money you need to, to buy these things a terabyte or a mark ii so don't worry about it all right. As you now, just pay attention to the job time uh, in the bottom right corner, right there. All right. It, it starts out at 30 minutes. I've got this. We're at just over a minute right now. I'm doing this all real time just to show you guys how simple and easy this is. Okay. Even if you had a buzzard or your own personal vehicle, you're only going to be adding just a few minutes on top of this. So don't worry about that, guys. Okay. I know a lot of you are like, Ty. You know, a lot of people comment. You got to have money to make money. Well, that is true. It does take money to make money. However, it doesn't take big money to make big money. You can have, you know, just the basic things in the game and still get a ton of money, especially with this method for this bonus event week. You will be, I mean, you're going to have drip drip all over you, all right? It'll be it'll be fun. You'll have a really good time, all right? Now, as you'll see, the job time is just at 28 minutes and 10 seconds. We're right at the two-minute mark. Uh, and I'm closing at the final location. I call Lester, get the cops off me. Very easy, very simple. I line up my oppressor with the uh, the yellow marker, the Corona ring. This swoop in right there. Look at that clock. We're just over two minutes, about two minutes and seven seconds to get thirty thousand five hundred. Okay. So do your client job first. That way your cooldown timer starts on those first, which make more money. And then you're just gonna run a VIP. Uh, mission, which will be like a headhunter or a sightseer, either one. Those take roughly the same amount of time between two, four minutes, two, and five minutes in that range right there. Um, once again, the Mark II is the better vehicle to use. If you don't have that, though, don't worry about it, okay? Once again, don't sweat that. I don't want that to deter you 
from using one of the best money guides and methods that's in the game, okay? If not the best money method in the game right now. Okay, so I'm just doing this again in real time to show you how easy and quick this can be done. Uh, if you've never done Headhunter, uh, if you're a newer player, it's real simple. As soon as you buy a CEO office, uh, actually, as soon as you have 50 grand in your bank, you're eligible to run VIP missions or their CEO VIP missions. Very, very simple. Headhunter and Sightseer are the easiest ones to do solo. You can do them in an invite only lobby. You don't even have to be in a public lobby to do those. Even with the client jobs, client jobs, you can do in an invite only lobby. I mean, that's why I've been wanting client jobs for double money for so long. But as you see right here, I'm even struggling. I'm, I'm just, I'm kind of, I'm talking to my friends, my crew members, and I'm not really paying attention, not focusing. But still, you just basically go around to four different targets and get some kills, and that's it. You may, and it takes no time at all. There's a 15 minute timer on this one. I've gotten these done in roughly two minutes. Uh, so once again, they're not hard. They're, it's very, very simple and easy. You can get these done in a vehicle. It takes a little bit longer, but it's not that big of a deal in the grand scheme of, of things. And like I said, after a day, man, <laughs> you'll have plenty of money. So that's my second target right there. Got that guy knocked out. There's two targets remaining. Even with the cops on you, you have a couple of stars. They're not going to be any kind of you know, nuisance. It's really not going to be that big of a deal. All right. And remember, if you are this completely brand new, totally fresh, I have tons of money making guides for beginners. I have great beginning guides for players to help you guys get started and to get you, you know, up and running and get you some money so you can start doing these things right here. And like I said, just to to do the basic VIP missions, all you need to have is 50 grand. You can get that just by doing a couple of missions. Hell, you can rob gas stations and convenience stores for a couple of days and get that, you know? So uh, that's all you have to have. I mean, no big deal. Got my third target wiped out with that. We're at 12 minutes and 35 seconds. So we're at two and a half minutes. And I get my last one right here. I'm shooting these guys up. I mean, it's really not that difficult. And then, you know, after a few minutes goes by, I get that knocked out. That's 21,000. I did that in under three minutes. And then I will run another client job, all right? So I'll have the, the, the cooldown timer will be done. I can run a different client job. And then after I run that client job, I'll be able to run a, another headhunter or sightseer, okay? Now, what if you don't have a terabyte, right? Or what if you have a terabyte, but you don't have all the client job missions? You haven't got that much money yet. Say you have some CEO special cargo warehouses, right? The crate warehouses. This method works awesome with the crates as well. Okay, it works really good if you have two warehouses. It doesn't matter what size, if it's a small, medium, or large, because all we're going for is nine crates, and we source the crates at three crates per trip. So you basically, if you have two warehouses, you need six trips at uh, three crates each, three per warehouse, or if you just have one, that's fine too, no big deal. All right, you launch that. You can launch it from your CEO office, which the CEO offices are on sale right now. If you don't have one of those, pick that up. The cheapest one is at 500 grand. And your CEO crate missions really don't, even if you get three crates just like this, I mean, you're, we're talking between seven and 10 minutes tops. You know, even quicker than that, five to, I mean, I've never spent more than 10 minutes on three crates before, so I wouldn't worry about that. And all these numbers work. It's, it's such a cool method to use. There's multiple ways to do this. So here's the math. Let's check this out. Import export right now, each car top range is selling at 120,000 per vehicle. All right, and you have a 20 minute cooldown. So you can sell basically three of those per hour. All right, and that's an equal 360,000 per hour. Inside that 20 minute cooldown time, you're gonna source, run a client job for 30K, a headhunter or sightseer for 20,000, another client job for 30,000, and then another headhunter and sites here for 20,000. And then the 20 minute cooldown timer should have expired and you'll be ready to sell another import export. So basically with this method right here, you're gonna have 360,000 per hour with import export sales and roughly 300,000 on client job and headhunter sales per hour. That equals $660,000 per hour. Then you add on your passive income, which is going to be your nightclub, your bunker, your MC businesses. That's going to average out to roughly $250,000 per hour. That equals $910,000 per hour. And like I said before, if you don't have the terabyte for the client jobs, 
and you know the headhunter sightseer missions you're not going to be doing those you can swap that out with running crates okay and amazing enough with the time to money ratio with the cooldown timer at 20 minutes you'll be averaging the same amount of money with the crates as you would with the client jobs and headhunter okay roughly another three hundred thousand dollars per hour equaling the same nine hundred and ten thousand dollars per hour and if you grind hard you put in five to six hours you're gonna make five million dollars in one day you hit it really hard you have a whole day off of work a saturday or a sunday or whatever you can make up to ten million dollars per day a hundred percent solo 100% legit guys and once again don't sweat it if you're a little under or over that is okay these numbers are averages but the whole point is, is that you will be in this ballpark and you'll be making some serious money legit you don't have to worry about nothing else get some good income on this okay you guys use this this is great money this is a really good effective method for this week I mean and even off the bonus event week this is still a great method to run and like I said 100% solo 100% legit follow the methods the more you do it the better off you'll be with it you can use a cargo Bob for import or export or not either way it is fine but now you know how much you can make if you really you know just put your head down get you some some uh you know some snacks some munchies some red bull and hit it up you know take a break every hour or so five ten minute break stretch it out walk around get you some water and uh get back to it and crush it and make this money man so you're looking at over nine hundred thousand per hour and between five and ten million per day on a good grind session man so there you have it if you guys have any questions at all let me know in the comments down below all right, make sure you subscribe to my channel for the illest and realest content in the game. Make sure you smash, I mean, smush, smash that like button. And you guys stay dangerous, all right? We'll see you in the next one. And man, get this money, all right? Don't, don't sleep on this. Peace out. Yeah.